That's the way we're used to seeing Flip Wilson, funky, funny, and outrageous. But Flip dropped out of show business five years ago, and we wondered why. His marriage had broken up, and he'd taken custody of three of his four kids. We caught up with him and his children at his home in Malibu. I uh, gave up the show at that time because uh, I had just acquired custody of my children. I discussed this with the children's mother, and uh, I wanted the children here so they could make the next step in their uh, growing up. Uh, and uh, it was her preference to stay in Florida, so there was no uh, disagreement as to what was best for the kids. I came from a large family. I went through a series of foster homes and farm schools, and I know what it was like. And uh, I feel that uh, if women are going to be liberated, then men must liberate themselves also. So I felt that uh, if a woman could raise a few kids working herself a few days a week, I know that with the means that I had, that I, w that I would be able to raise these kids. I'm extremely proud of the children. They are my best friends. But I think that the uh, two most gratifying points are uh, when I first uh, received custody of uh, Tammy, her hair was in a very short natural. And I've always felt that a woman's hair was a beauty. And uh, I've nursed her uh, hair along very much. I've always been concerned about the girl's hair, and I'm very pleased with where their hair is now from where it was at that time, which was a very short natural. Isn't that correct? Uh, I will go up a wall about their hair. Uh, my next biggest thrill is... Uh, <clears throat> watching her mature. Watching her uh, become more feminine. Watching her concern about... Watching her breasts grow. And watching her... Uh, asking where's the bubble bath, and uh, things like that. Of the four, I spanked you once, right? Mm -hmm. uh, and I spanked you twice, and I was wrong both times. Uh, I don't think I've ever spanked you, have I? No. I have? Once, I think. Oh, what was that for? for putting a lot of salt on Terry's eggs. That's right, for putting a lot of salt on her eggs. That's right, I forgot I spanked her. Uh, uh, but let me tell you what happened. Uh, when I get ready to spank one, I have the others there to judge. Uh, at the time I got ready to spank this young lady, uh, I waited until she went to sleep, and uh, then uh, I called the other kids and uh, took them in the room. I said, I'm going to spank her. And I woke her up and I told her that I'm going to spank you. And uh, uh, each time that I uh, uh, hit you with the belt, it was a little thin belt uh, strap, uh, I want you to repeat this line. That I will not do that again. I forget what it was. I think you'd slam somebody's hand in the door or something. What was that? I don't remember. It was something, well, anyway. So, uh, she said, okay, Daddy. So she pulled her pajamas down. So I hit her one time, she said the line. I won't do that anymore. So I hit her a second time, she said the line. I won't do that anymore. So I hit her three times, she said the line. But she hadn't cried yet. So uh, I'm wondering, uh, why, is she, why isn't she crying? So I hit her again, she said the line. And uh, I'm still shook that she's not crying. And uh, <clears throat> <clears throat> it concluded <clears throat> with us saying, uh, Daddy, <clears throat> Daddy, when is enough? And that was it. She never cried. I never spanked her again. She remembers. She remembers. You remember, don't you? I was so concerned with being a good parent 
that I might have pressed it more than I should have at the moment. And even in the case that I did, uh, I made a mistake. I admitted it. But, uh, uh, and I think the tears just might reflect the fact that I could just not believe that they were that good. And they are. Coming up next, a 2020 look at the chance of nuclear terrorism in this country. And it's some who've raised the possibilities.